All right, guys, hello, and welcome to the Cantrip Cast. It is I, Brandon, the Dungeon Master. I still hate that Yeah, I know. I have time. to do it every time now. But why do you say it, it, is, it is I? It is I. I know. It just you sound dumb. Well. <laughs> <laughs> it is because I, it, Brandon of Tranconia. We have more rabbits Dranconia. for sale today. <laughs> Tranconia. Uh, like, where do they even come from? The rabbits? No, Draco- Draconia, whatever the hell it is that you That's saying. A fictional hey, how do you spell it? D R. No, it starts with a T. And then Dr- a silent- oh, it's Draconia? Yeah, it's T, and then a silent Q, <laughs> then an R, then an A, and the Batman sign. <laughs> that is a terrible Batman. <laughs> then another Q, then an N, then a third Q. <laughs> Then I O N I A. Draconia. I fucking hate you, and I'm saving this layer. Draconia! Just making it go away. Cool. Anyways, welcome to the Cantrip Cast. And today we're doing another really weird, fucked up, goofy um, character drawing. Except this time I haven't looked at any of the things that people have said. I posted another few uh, questions on Reddit and some Facebook subforums and whatnot to kind of get some ideas and make another really messed up homebrew monster. And this time I have our buddy Greg here with me, but he's going to be commentating on my poorly drawn art skills and uh, crappy artistic style while giving me features of a homebrew monster. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid because well, I don't know what's coming. First things first, we need a body type. So my favorite is a dwarf that has giantism. A Dwarf that has giantism. Yes. All right. Well, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna start off with like a, a base structure here. So we're gonna get like. Ooh, redhead. Well, it's gonna. This is just the outline. Ooh. Should, how should the guy look? Is he gonna look like cocky, sad, like? Um. Well, the one descriptive tone that we had on our Discord. He's a bigger head. Which is um, big ass head. There we go. You know the what is it? What is our Discord called? Because I'm a bad person. We can't trip a D and D Discord. We can't trip a D and D Discord. It was um. Uh, he wa- his face needs to look like a thirteen year old that thinks they're right. A third, okay. Like, mom, I know what I'm doing. I went to the mall five times. I bought shoes last week. Duh. We'll wait for that. Okay. Oh well, hey. well, there goes his penis. I'll put. You know, I'm gonna put a bulge in just for you. I don't like the beard, anyways. And again, as you can tell, that's a Brandon Tharp little beard. One of the littlest in the game goes down to his belly button. We need this guy. Uh, let's give him some bushy ass eyebrows, like I was doing before. I feel like this is a personal attack. Yeah, this is just we're just drawing Greg. That's what we're doing right now. We're drawing Greg's alter ego. In the words of Michelle Tanner, how rude. What kind of facial expression is he gonna have? Uh, I guess a good way to put it would be trite. <laughs> Just, mm, I know better than you. <laughs> I've won a thousand games of Fortnite all by myself. Solo mode. That's the face you're looking for. Okay. Ungrateful douchebag. Okay. Lower the opacity of this bottom layer here so I can kind of... Okay. You know what? Fuck it. He's going full Amish. You give him a, oh, just a little mustache or no mustache? Nope, no mustache. Just so straight, a, straight that, neck beard. For yeah. all you beard fans out there, that's called a Donegal. That's what it's called? Yes, yes it that. is. Oh, nice, cool. And yeah, now you know knowledge is power. All right, so I guess we're going to have... Is he going to be beefy? Is he going to be muscular? Like, what's uh, He's going to have to be a little beefy because his body is that of an orca whale. What? <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> what? Yeah, it's he's got a big orca whale body. He's not anthropomorphic. Uh, just has the body of an orca whale with human arms and legs. Okay. Well, fuck all of that. <laughs> the head looks great. Orca whale? How the fuck am I supposed to? You know how an orca whale is shaped. You Do I? Ta- you have a tattoo of it on your back. No, I don't. I guess we're going to move him over here. You're going to have to. He's got a big body. <laughs> Fuck it, that's fine. All right, well. Everyone knows this is a giant dwarven orca whale. (laughs) 
Don't forget the dorsal fin. <laughs> oh, God. Dorsal orcas? Oh, yeah, they do. You're right. Mm -hmm. No. It's like a flipper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do this. Oh, no! This is when you've done too much. There you go. I don't like it. There you go. Easy That's beefy. a little wide. Yeah. That looks nope. like a, nope, keep it. That looked like a banana. <laughs> <laughs> which, is, which is also another feature that you're going to have to try to find a way to work in. A banana? It is. Fuck it, that's good enough. All right. An enormous carnivorous banana. Dorsal fin. Okay. Nailed it. I'm going to, I'll fix, I'll fix all this shit in a minute. Okay. So orca whale body. Ripped. Dwarven ripped head. Arms. Ripped arms. Like the rock. Like Dwayne the Rock Johnson arms. Dwayne. <laughs> Like, imagine this orca jumping off a skyscraper onto a separate skyscraper. Oh, yeah, he means business. You can tell. Yeah, I'm going to be a little vein action here. Oh, yeah. Some veinies. I can't draw hands. Don't judge my fucking hands. What about a fist? I can't do I, I I'm still learning how to draw hands. I'm an amateur. Don't judge me. Okay. I always judge you. Uh, I guess I'm going to give him his other hand. Yeah. He definitely looks ready to grapple. Oh, yeah. He's ready for business. He's, yeah. He's like, why are you in my waters? And, you know, this doesn't state anything on the Reddit page, but um, what I would like to see is the legs come down. His legs? Yeah. His, he's not like a water animal? No, no. He's got big, beefy human legs. What? But I'd like them to come in the middle of the body Hold instead on one of the sec. back side of where the, the end of the whale is. Okay. Come well, down from like the stomach. So like from here? No. Higher. Or like he <laughs> Jesus. Yes. Hold like on. he's got a whole back like that's his whole tail. So like here. Nope. No, higher? higher? <laughs> like here. Yes. What kind of legs? Giant meaty, beefy, muscular legs. Oh, that looks horrifying. All right, they're going to have to start, like, up here, then. Oh, yeah. Look at that. You'd have to, you know what? If you assumed what this guy's glutes were going to look like. Whew. That foot is fucking horrible. Uh, his left knee is going to be a little wonky. Sure, good enough for the foot. What about his what? He's got a little wonky knee on the left side. Yeah, well. No, no, that's what he needs to have. Oh. <laughs> We're just having like kicking out. That's the right leg, you loon. Oh, just, you know what? Fuck you. So if you look at our YouTube videos, you can check out the last homebrewed monster, uh, which Brandon misspelled the name almost immediately. Okay, I didn't mean to. I said, give me a name. You gave me one, and I just glanced at it real quick. He's going to have beefy legs, too. Here we go. Oh, he, yeah, he does have yeah, veiny, legs. Some veiny boys here. How else is he going to stop All right, cool. cars and stuff? So we got the dwarf head, the orca whale body. I guess he needs, like, a little underbelly, right, for, like, an orca whale body. Like, they have, like, an under, like, kind of, like, shaded, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, one of those. Okay. Kind of looks like a fucked up Godzilla, but all right. Don't forget his blowhole. It's a whale. Wouldn't that be on his head, though? I mean, technically, he could be. So, like, he's got to have, like, a little... <laughs> so, we're going to do... Watch this. <laughs> oh, that's a little too big. You know what? Yeah, we're just going to keep it like that. Damn it. And then we'll have some... No. We're going to keep it like that. You didn't like it? I liked it. Look good. Look good, play good. Okay, so there's a blue hole now. All right, what now? Um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't exactly know how to draw this part, but. Oh, great. So you think I can? Yeah. <laughs> um, he needs to have a foot fetish or a shoe fetish. What? Because when the party goes to sleep, he tries to steal their shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> oh, you know what? No, I know what to do. I know what to do. Hold on. We're going to draw, like, you know, like, uh, in the streets, like, in, like, you know, bad neighborhoods, you see, like, those shoes hanging over the telephone lines? Yeah. Okay, we're just going to have, like, at the end of his tail, just, like, 
party member's shoes. Yeah. It's like, here's some, like, shoe strings in here. Shit here. They're gonna come down. It's kind of like... And we're just gonna draw some shoes. Hanging, hanging by the end of his... Those are horrible shoes. I can't draw shoes. I can't do feet or hands. Like, why are they so hard? Uh, sure. Here's some Jordans. <laughs> Those are real bad Jordans. <laughs> Here's some Crocs. Here's another. I don't know what it is. Sure, he's got shoes hanging from his tail. All right, cool. How are you at drawing crab parts? Crab parts? Yes. What kind? Now, what kind of crabs are we talking about? First well, of all, we have, it, other than being a giant dwarven whale uh, with human arms. And are you legs. talking like crabs? No, no, not like. You mean crabs. like? We're not talking about you oh, know. God. How am I gonna do that? Cameron much? Ford in two thousand seventeen. <laughs> Cameron Ford in Detroit right now. We're talking about crabs, as in I pinch, I pinch. Okay, so what kind of crab part? Well, we have to for? make you know a compromise here because it was going to be a <laughs> coconut crab that the coconut folded open to become a crab, and it was made of coconut. So what? we need to have coconut esque claws instead of those hands. I got to delete the hands. God damn it! All right, <laughs> hold on. And you have coconut hands. Co- coconut crab hands. Uh, duh. Everybody knows what coconut crab hands are like. I don't. If you asked your fiance right now what coconut hands of a crab would look like, no, not, you're making it too coconutty. You need to have more crabby. Crab like pinchers with a coconut exterior. <laughs> Brown and furry coconut crab hands. Fuck. Hold on. I know. The, okay. I know what to do. I'm going to. I'm going to try a thing. Isn't that what this whole thing is about? <laughs> to try a thing? Yeah, you're right. Oops. Fuck me. <laughs> that one. At this oh. point, it looks like he has a hoof. Why can I not draw anything? Anything? <laughs> if, if it's, hand, it's not even a hand. It's, it's just like supposed to be a coconut. Anything that goes on an appendage in the front of your body. Okay, good enough. See, we got like a cracked open coconut. So what I'm going to do is this. Oop. See? Oh, fuck. Wrong one. So you like there. And the outside is going to be brown when I color it. It has like a coconut. Do you know what the color of a coconut is? Yeah. The What color is it? Yeah, like brown. Yes, but on the inside. I don't know. White! You right, eat, well, the coconut is white! Okay. In gray hands. Yeah, I guess coconut have... hands. Coconut crab hands. There's some crab hands coming out of... Sure. Wait, hold on. You're making, you're making his hands actual, <laughs> actual coconuts with crabs inside them. Yes. Good compromise. I dig it. Because I don't know how to draw half this shit, so I'm just gonna, we're just gonna go. Oh, fuck, we're just gonna go with it. I like it. I'm just doing. Should I do both hands like that, or just the one? I I'm okay with having one regular human hand. Okay, I'm fine with that too. And one <laughs> crab. Hand. That's fine with me. Coconut, <laughs> a hand that is a coconut with a crab inside of it. Yeah. That's like a mechanical servant. Um, let's have like little beady eyes like popping over here too. It's like, why am I in a coconut? But here, why am I, I, why am I in a coconut attached here. to someone's forearm? <laughs> here I am though. Here's my claws. They call me Risty McCrab. <laughs> Jesus fuck. All right, what's next? Uh, let's see here. I gotta go to jumping between multiple places here. Okay. Um, why am I doing this? So it looks like we need to have some tentacles. Uh, fuck. From where? Honestly, at this point, I think you can go anywhere above the arms and in between that and the dorsal fin. <laughs> That's a sentence I never thought I'd say. <laughs> um, 
You know what I really want to do? What? I know what I want to do. I'm going to show you. This isn't about you, Brandon. Well, this I'm the one drawing it, so you can respect... Your authority? Yes. <laughs> now that just looks like somebody's head got placed on top of a, a shark. Oh, just wait. You'll see. If I can erase. I know what you're doing. Do you? I do. Do you know what I'm doing? I'm not going to say anything until yeah, it's done. You, know, you know. know what I'm doing. I you know, know where I'm going with this. All right, here we go. Doing. Another excellent compromise. Uh, <laughs> for some of these facial beard tentacles, um, you do need to be made aware that they will shoot candy corn. But it's to heal party members. Okay. Absolutely horrifying. All right. I think we kind of got... The dwarf in them kind of got lost, but that's fine. All right, what now? So this one states uh, by Darth Acidocious. Okay. It, he wants it to be a monster who looks and feels like a DBZ villain. A DBZ act, villain. Acts super powerful, yells crazy to power up, and he just gets massive yellow hair. <laughs> well, all right. I guess we're going to... So I guess we know what to do with the mouth now. Do we? Yeah, he's got to be yelling. Ah! Yeah. Just... Ah! All right. I got to give him the DBZ. I, I got to give him the, the uh, DBZ here. So we're going to keep the blowhole. The blowhole's got to stay. Oh, yeah. But you know what we're going to do. Breathe? You know what we're going to do, though? He's going to be an old man. He's going to have, like, split hair. And then what we can do is, you know, we're going to go, we're going to go Super Saiyan 3 with this bitch. No, we'll keep him Super Saiyan 2. Okay. And uh, what was my favorite comment, and I wanted you to find a way to add this element into it at the very end. Okay. Enormous carnivorous banana. What? So, I mean, he has a whale's body, but that whale body technically could be that of a whale banana. So, a whale nanner. Yes. I got it. Hold on. I got it. When he approaches I... in water, it goes, nope, nanner, I nanner, got nanner, it. nanner, nanner, All right, nanner, I don't want to lose, I don't want to lose the shoes. I'm going to keep the shoes. All right, so we're going to, I'm going to copy that. Okay, we're going to move it just to be safe. Oops, wrong tool. Okay. Okay, I'm going to keep that there. For later. It's still there. We're going to need it. But you're going to love this. That's okay. That's pretty good. I will give you credit. It's split. The banana split. That looks nothing like a banana. It doesn't look bad. It's it like just... corn. <laughs> okay, that's true. You're too pointy. Yeah, it is I've never had that pointy. pointy of a banana. You ever had a pointy banana? Not like that. Well, I've had some pointy bananas. I've been to college. I'll tell you that. Oh, that's just like a nub. No, oh, that's not good. That looked like corn off the cob. Sure. Sure. Like what? I like it. Yeah, I'm gonna fix the the shoestring tails over here. I'm gonna get rid of that because it's still gonna be there and attached. All right, let's zoom back out. We're gonna go back up and grab our shoes, and we're gonna throw the shoes over top of the banana because we are looking for a drug deal. Perfect. Okay. Anything else? Uh, now we need to name it. Oh, fuck. This is... 
Well, obviously color it, but also... Well, I'm going to cut... You, well, you need to finish the crab legs, too. You, you got to finish the crab legs. There's two legs popping out. Why would he... He's just stepping he's out scared. on the right side. Yeah. Fine, I'll add some more. Hold on. I'm just going to... I'll fix that when I color it. There, he's got... He's at four now. That's respectable. He's out there. He's here. He's noticeable. He's peeking out. Why am I attached to this man's arm in a coconut? Okay. You think of a name while I start coloring this thing. I think I'm done with this thing. <laughs> I'm, I, can't, I can't keep going. This is ridiculous. Okay. What's his official name? Leonardo da Pinci. <laughs> <laughs> Leonardo. Hey. Pinchy. Leonardo de Pinchy. Are you fucking kidding me? Yes. <laughs> no, but you're serious. This is the worst part about it. Yes. All right, cool. Thanks, Internet. You've created the next homebrew monster, Leonardo de Pinchy. Um... And again, just like uh, Sandalov, I, I hate it. <laughs> I absolutely hate it. I love it. I don't. But, you know, all right, I guess I'm going to throw this into video and edit it out so you guys can see just how bad this is. And All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching me draw a very poorly drawn cartoon homebrew monster that was made by people answering questions on the internet. My name is Brandon Tharp, and I am joined by... Gregory! Brown. Completely unnecessary. And uh, yeah, if you like what we did, you want to see more of this kind of stuff or more of the content that we've been uh, making over the past couple weeks, months Brown. or whatever, <laughs> make sure you like and subscribe. Um, if there is a creature or some sort of trait you want to see and to do in another creature video, make sure you uh, comment down below. Comment some uh, really funny, stupid stuff that we can go ahead and uh, draw together and throw together for another homebrew monster of sorts. Um, again, like, subscribe. We'd really appreciate it. Make sure you check out the podcast. We can trip a dandy podcast. Uh, we just released a new episode this week. We released it weekly. We are on episode 32 this week. And, uh, yes, we are. The show is growing tremendously. Make sure you join our Discord. If you have Discord as well, we have a pretty cool community growing on there. It is We Can Trip a dandy Discord. You can find all that and the links to our social media and our Discord and everything else down in this stuff all down there below that's in all the rest of the YouTube videos that people do. Any final words before we go, Greg? Um, never stop believing in yourself, never stop believing in others, and Brandon is the worst person I've ever met. And if you ever see Leonardo da Pinci in the streets, run for your goddamn lives. Unless you see him in the sheets.